Hey YouTube, it's me, Baby Zane. Today we are doing chemo round five. And as you can see, it says I'm feeling nauseous, but I'm feeling blessed with Anthony. So my baby boy has decided to come with me today to witness this process with me. So right now my um, my bag of Perceptin is running in and I've had my pre-meds, my steroids, my medicine, my um, anti-itch medications are going in and I'm here with my mother-in-law who practically brings me to every visit. Today, Anthony is here. Yep. I'm so, here to witness her today. And I'll be here for quite a few of these situations. So, uh, YouTube, you might as well get used to seeing my face. And this is very promising because when you're going through a process like this, family is very important. And um, I did have a lack of immediate family support. Um, you know, people had to get through their, their, I guess, their fears of what will happen and get through um, going through the acceptance. There are, like, stages of it. There's anger. There's denial. There's acceptance and there's coping sickness and then sometimes death but we don't want to think about that aspect of it but today I had my taxidermy doses decrease because I was very sick at around four and going into treatments after round four. Today, like I said, we're in round five. My taxidermy dose has been decreased. And I'm hoping that I won't feel sick. It is one week before Thanksgiving. Today is November the 18th. Thanksgiving is next Thursday, so I don't want to go into that um, feeling sick. I'm not sure if I'll be able to prepare dinner because I can't stand up for long periods of time. Um, I get kind of windy going into the grocery store. Um, I don't really feel like cleaning up anymore. Just vacuuming the floor is very exhausting. Um, I still have like cystic acne type breakouts. And like I said before, I am controlling my skincare with um, castor oil, olive oil, sunflower oil, um, Jehovah oil mixed together and rubbing it into my skin and it's giving me a really hydrated look. Um, my skin's not flaky or anything like that. And my nurse today is Christy again and she's the one that you saw in the last video that was wearing um, her little hippie outfit because it was Halloween. Now I'm at round five and what's going to happen is round six is my last triple treatments and then I just take the Herceptin treatments for until August. So I'm pretty excited about that. I think that means that I have decreased visits to the hospital but they're still going to have to monitor my heart. As a matter of fact, I'm going to have to go to Heart Doctor tomorrow so that they can check it out and see what's going on. And then, depending on how strong my heart is, they're going to determine um, how much perception that they'll need to give me. And as we sit here and wait, just four to six hours or however long it takes, we are listening to The Secret. 
which is a um, a motivational book. Um, it's been um, reviewed by lots of famous people, and I'm hoping that that gives me a positive outlook and an a positive outlook. So hopefully, coming out of this one won't be so bad, and there's promise for future. That's the most important point. But until I see you the next time, um, I want to say peace. And don't forget that I um, I am going to do the video on skincare. Um, to help you ladies with that dry, flaking discoloration in your skin. And um, how to look your best while you go through chemo. Because you just shouldn't look, go through chemo. Like you're just ready to lay down and give it up. You need to fight it. The outside needs to be just as beautiful as you were before you started. And at night, you do your reveal of who you really are and who you really look like. But the rest of the world does not have to know that you're suffering on a daily basis. That's just what I'm taking out of it. I feel like my face forward should be the best that I can put forward. And then at night when it's time for me to meditate pray and do all the other things that I need to do and then I'm looking in the mirror at what this disease is really doing to me but I love you my YouTube fans please keep subscribing and believe in your hearts and minds that this will be fixed so that it can manifest so, that's what we need y'all to do. Believe so it shall be. Pray. Pray. Believe. And we'll get through this. That's all we need. Bye, Facebook. I'll see you for round six. Round six is the end of my triple treatment. I'll just be taking her septum until August. So, maybe I'll start to partially get my life back together. I have surgery scheduled for January, which is my, um, my swap out tissue expander swap out. And then I still have to keep my port in for eight more months after that. And then another surgery. And hopefully I'll be done. I'll be done. I can lose weight. If my doctor don't decide to do my tummy tuck. And hey, I might come out of this better than I went in. <laughs> okay, so that's all for now. See you Facebook. Bye.